All right, so what is going on, everybody? My name is Joel, AK Orb, and a few days have passed since the biggest event of the year for me, which is my annual Call of Duty release marathon stream that I do every single year. Well, I have been. Who knows what's going to happen next year? But this year's was very, very successful. Uh, and as I said, it's been a couple of days. I think we are, as of now, we are unconfirmed the first uh, Max Prestige on PC uh, when we actually did it on Monday. Was it Monday evening? or was it Tuesday morning I cannot I think it was I think it was actually Tuesday morning uh, when we actually um, reached max prestige but here here's the kicker guys here's the ugly kicker if you will we don't really know if we're I say unconfirmed first because uh, leaderboards on PC uh, I haven't checked in the last two days because I've been kind of you know after all this marathon streaming I've just been taking uh, time away from the keyboard away from the computer just spending time with, with my girlfriend Michelle uh, and just doing nothing I mean we did go to the movies but just like relaxation mode after a what 11 day marathon which is kind of insane so I'll be kind of taking time off, but at the time, uh, even after 11 days, PC leaderboards were not in effect, which, I mean, it could either be a good or a bad thing, because I know a lot of people cheat just for the fact that they want to become first on the leaderboards, uh, and I didn't run into that many hackers. Now, on PC, we always going to have hackers, uh, but this year, I feel like there was not that many. Um, obviously, you ran into a couple of your, your obvious spin bot aim botters that were just, like, kind of kicking ass, um, but I don't think I've noticed too many, like, people trying to hide aim bot or tr trying to hide wall hack, rather. Uh, so I feel like cheaters this year on the release was less and maybe that is because there was no leaderboards I'm not really sure or because nobody gave a shit about infinite warfare I know player base on PC has been well let's just come out and say it has been pretty wonky let's just come out and say it the player base have been pretty shitty uh, this year but um, I haven't had a problem finding games and such which I, I, I kind of um, praise because uh, um, that would be one hell of a bad turnout if I can't even find games uh, when searching uh, when when trying to do the marathon obviously that would be uh, a really bad thing but TDM games I was always able to find but I know we're two minutes into the commentary but I just want to say that Everybody that tuned in for the marathon, whether just for, you know, a day, whether just for one session, uh, maybe it was for the entire thing. If you guys tuned in at any point uh, and was showing love and chatting with us and and uh, just sharing the, the marathon experience, I want to thank you guys for tuning in and stopping by. This year has by far been the most successful, and I'm not only talking about concurrent viewers because I feel the most I ever had for concurrent viewers was Black Ops 2. And I feel like a lot of people look back on that and be like, man, this year was not 8,000 concurrent. It was like more like, you know, one. 2.5, 2,000 uh, for the most part. So um, they might see it as like, oh man, it's not as successful. But in terms of people showing love, whether that be through cheering on, on Twitch, donations, subscribers, uh, people just being overall excited and chatting with us and, and, and kind of being involved in the marathon with every everything from all the giveaways to just all the good times we had. I feel like this has been the biggest success and not, not to mention the fact that, you know, I did it with my girlfriend Michelle. So that meant that we did eight hour shifts each. So, you know, you got a time to sleep, you got a time to eat, kind of get time away from the monitor just like not playing the same ga game over and over and over again you actually got to break away uh, and I feel like that did so much for just like me being able to be entertaining on camera when I'm playing you know that does a lot instead of me playing you know the, the usual the previous years you know we've done I've well I've done it solo obviously and I've done 20 hours streaming and four hours sleeping after a few days you um, feel pretty damn shitty inside and outside and on every on every different level you just feel kind of like trash so uh getting as i said getting to shower eat sleep take away some time off it was amazing um and i had a way better time this year than i have had in the previous year so who knows if this is something we're gonna do for future years but i definitely feel like this is kind of the right formula now obviously i've learned i learn new things every year about what i want to improve for next year uh and i'm definitely taking some things away from this year too on how to make better or what things to keep things to throw away um, and stuff like that, but I feel like if it's, it's been a big success uh, just for me personally how it went and how I felt with my body how I feel now after the marathon I'm actually really excited to jump back on and stream which last year was like man Let me take like a week off which now I feel like I want to jump back on the horse as soon as possible But this video is just kind of sitting down with you guys and chatting and, and showing appreciation uh, To everybody that that tuned in and if you guys missed it this year um, I'm sorry. Hopefully there will be something next year for you guys to tune in on 
Uh, obviously, we have VODs up on Twitch for you guys that kind of want to relive a certain uh, certain moments here and there. Uh, in terms of nukes, I know a lot of people have been excited for you know the nuke returning, and maybe the Moab King will kind of make a return. I dropped two nukes in the marathon, and Michelle, she dropped two nukes on PC, and here's the kicker, guys, with a controller. And I'm sure I'm gonna try to feature one of those gameplays if her music wasn't too loud. She likes to blast music a lot louder than I do, and obviously with copyrighted music and YouTube, uh, that kinda doesn't go together very well. But I don't know if you can figure out another way, maybe do a commentary over the gameplay, um, or maybe the, um, I don't know. I I'll have to go and check how, how loud the music is on her VOD, but she did kick some major ass. Uh, I just wanna show some love for Michelle. Everybody stop and buy. I wanna show some love for Chris P. For all the graphics, uh, all the companies, we had Racer, MSI, Elgato, and Activision all coming in with some great giveaways. And uh, man, they just kind of put the icing on the cake when it came to just user, um, just interaction. You guys are joining in and 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 doing some fun, uh, some fun stuff for some some giveaways. Uh, it was an absolute blast. And I know the YouTube channel has been kind of barren here uh, the last two weeks due to the marathon and due to me not having enough time to prepare videos. I did actually prepare the videos, but I did not have a time to upload and fix thumbnails and all that. And then I was kind of like, if I don't want to, you know, kind of, if I'm not going to go all the way, I don't really want to upload, you know, videos that don't have a proper thumbnail and all that stuff. So hopefully business will go back to normal. Uh, I'm kind of debating right now on what I want to upload for the channel uh, and what I kind of want to... I don't know. Take a break with it, let you say. I know, like, I my 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 enthusiasm to play CS:GO has gone down a lot. So, so the odds of our solo to global or our road to global in CS:GO is going to continue for now. Uh, that's kind of going to go on a halt for a little bit uh, while I try to figure out what I want to do. So, if you guys are looking for a different type of content, definitely check out the YouTube channel or the Twitch channel rather. If you guys haven't already on Twitch.tv slash or I'm live five days a week, seven hours on those days, uh, and that is kind of my main priority right now. Uh, YouTube is fun and all, but it, it's very time consuming and I'm not really getting back what I'm putting in. Um, so therefore kind of motivation to YouTube is is a little bit down. I'm not, I wouldn't say I'm, I'm quitting or anything like that, but uh, I wanna make sure that, that the Twitch channel gets the treatment it deserves because I'm getting, um, we have a lot of support for the Twitch channel. We have a lot of, of paying subscribers and people tuning in every day. And I wanna try to give them the best possible content that I can. And then when I have, um, you know, time over and stuff like that, that's when I do YouTube or that's when, you know, the Twitch highlights and stuff like that will, will hit the YouTube channel. Um, so I'm, I'm kind of, I'm kind of on the fence what I want to do with the YouTube channel, to be honest with you guys. Um, and it's not really where I'm asking you guys, man, what do you guys want to see? Cause I don't really know what I want to upload myself. Like if I knew that to begin with, then I could ask you guys and I can kind of be like, man, I want to upload this and the viewers want to see this. Uh, and I can kind of, you know, go from there. Cause that is obviously the type of content you guys are going to enjoy the most. And I'm going to have the most fun creating. But, um, once again, guys, I want to thank you all for tuning in for the marathon. If you guys missed it, you definitely missed out, but that's okay. Hopefully we'll be back, we'll be back next year, uh, with a bigger and better event than this year. But guys, it's been really nice sitting down to talk to you guys. I, I don't know what we've been featuring in the background. I'm assuming it's some Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. Uh, I don't know if it's from the marathon. I don't know if it's from pre-release. I don't really know. Uh, but I hope you have enjoyed the video nonetheless. Just sitting down, catching up a little bit, uh, and talking about anything and everything. But, guys, that is going to be it for this video. Rate, comment, do your thing, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Later. Bye-bye.